Steven Spielberg, we were friends for many, many years, and he called me one day and he said he had this wonderful script and he had a young writer on it, a kid named Chris Columbus. He went on to be one of the better directors in the business. But I, I read this script, Steven sent it over to the house, and I, I couldn't stop laughing. I fell madly in love with it. And there's nothing in the world better for a director than to work with this raw talent of children. There's no affectations. And you, you have this wonderful opportunity to kind of pull the best out of these wonderful, fresh young minds. And we had a wonderful time casting it. We ended up with this wonderful group of children. And I had the best time I think I've ever had in my life. And when the picture was over, the children were very strange. Here we had shot for maybe uh, 10 weeks. And it was this wonderful homogenous family and a lot of love and a lot of hugs and a lot of laughing and crying. But this last week, it was very strange. They were, they were very alienated to me. And I, I thought, well, I don't know that much about children, I guess, because um, I, thought I, I thought I really knew these kids inside and out by now. I was very disillusioned, and I decided I was going to take a week or two off before I went into the editing. So I flew over to Hawaii, and one day, as I walked on, out onto the lawn to look at the sunset, and the, I saw Josh Brolin, who played the oldest son in the movie, coming up the lawn, and he had a surfboard. I said, what the hell is he doing here? And he came over and he said, oh, oh hi, Dick. He said, uh, I would just stop by. You know, I told you I was going to go surfing. And uh, the, I said, oh, yeah. He said, well, my mother, my mother took me to Hawaii. And I just, I said, oh, great. But he kept looking behind me. And I turned around, and there was the entire cast, the heavies, the adults, the children, everybody. Spielberg had flown them all over as a surprise for me. And he had told them a week before that if anybody tipped it, and I found out they were coming, the trip would be off. So that week of total alienation was the best acting those kids ever did, because they in no way tipped it. And here I had these kids, but Spielberg, the deal was they could only stay two hours, and they was gonna fly them to another island, and they were gonna get a vacation, because he wasn't gonna impose. But I fell so in love with them to have them there. They, we, we, we bought out the supermarket, had a great barbecue, they stayed the night, sleeping bags all over the place, and, uh, it was one of the great put-ons, and I called Spielberg and I said, watch your back, pal.